All right, so it is Saturday the 29th. Here's where we stayed last night. Jerry Cabin Shelter. Our plan right now is 10 miles because it's really late. We got in so late and we're so freaking cold last night that uh, it's almost 11 o'clock and we're starting now. So as you can tell, no matter how hard we tried, no one came through in the middle of the night and broke trail for us. So we're going to be post holing again with frozen feet. And uh, looking to get to uh, what theoretically is a hostel in 10 miles for the night. If that doesn't work, we're going to figure something else out. All right, let's go. So here's the... Uh, the top of something, at least we hope it's the top. And all I can say is, it's kicking my ass. I think we've only been about a mile. And uh, probably walking in, what do you think, six, seven inches? At least. At least of snow. So each step is like, you know, kind of like we run on the sand. I think I've already said that before, but it's true. I haven't said that. Look around. It's beautiful. So we're hoping to make this shelter, or excuse me, the... I can't think. Uh, hostel. Hostel. Hope we'll make the hostel tonight. And hope it's not too bad. Because <laughs> if we don't, we're going to have to make some other decisions. And since we got such a late start, we're probably going to get to the hostel area around 4.30 or so, 5 o'clock. So we'll see how it goes. But it is beautiful. We're about a mile up from the shelter. And it is kicking my butt. So our hope is to get to uh, a hostel in about 9 miles. And see if it's good enough to stay in if it's not we have some decisions to make so what we find ourselves doing is trudging through snow uh, t-rex take one step back take one step back there you can see in front of us there's no tracks we're blazing new trail and this is how much snow we're dealing with So, looks like about 9, 10 inches of snow. So, more than I expected. But, having said all that, look at the view. It's absolutely gorgeous. So we'll see how the day goes. All right, we just crossed Big Butt. We hiked Big Butt. We cannot yeah, lie. I wasn't going to do that joke, but I guess I have to now. We just crossed Big Butt, and we cannot lie, <laughs> and came out in this beautiful pasture. But what's interesting is if you can see down there, there's no snow down there. We need to get down there. See. All right, let's keep going. I think we've only gone maybe two miles. So just off the trail, there's an area called Shelton Graves, which If Goodlooks is correct, Shelton's came home in the Civil War. They were Union soldiers. And they came home to see their family and were killed.
there's Shelton Graves. All right, let's get back on the trail. We've got to uh, meet the rest of the other guys at the water spot and like two tenths of a mile and then onward. Yes, starting to see ground. We've dropped a bit in elevation and hopefully that's a good sign. So we're at the bottom of really the only climb today. It's not terribly bad. Just got all the snow always makes it worse. So we met up with two other hikers who camped behind us. Surprised us actually. Uh, we just call them 88, 89. They're tag numbers. Uh, here we go. Let's get it done. All right. So we're coming down into Devil's Fork Gap. I think the current plan is we go over that style right there. Another four or five tenths of a mile. And we're gonna hope this uh, hostel is open. All right, so we got down to Hector something road, and I believe that's the hostel over there. We're gonna find out here in a minute. Yep, I see a sign. We've been told it's kind of sketchy. We'll find out. Let's go find out. Let's so make yourself at home. I'll make myself at home. This hostel is definitely looking up. Paul, right? Yeah. Paul, I guess he's owner's son, right? Owner's son, yeah. What's up? He grabbed us some pizza from Johnson City. Yeah, man. Oh, we're going to tear that up. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. Thanks again. Yeah, man. <laughs> nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. This is one happy hiker. A little bit of pizza. I'm going to put an awesome comment on that. Good night. <laughs>